Well, here we are, middle of nowhere, Escalante, Utah. We're at the Grand Staircase National Monument in southern Utah. We just drove about eight miles out of dirt road to the Zebra Slot Canyon. It's about a little over six miles. There's a surprising number of people here because we were out in the middle of nowhere. Uh, all right. So we've been walking through this wash for about a mile and a half. And uh, it's starting to look a little more canyony. We have walls on either side now. There's this fence right here. Looks like people cross on the very edge to get by. Well, the last half mile we've been walking through some deep sand and losing morale quickly. <laughs> but I think we may finally see a canyon up here. Now this is more like it. Yeah, this is cool. Uh, <laughs> yep, that's literally a tumbleweed. <clears throat> oh boy. I'm gonna take off my smoke. It did say you might I saw something about backpacks being Oh really? Oh boy. It, it widens up up here. Oh man. Well, I'll take that back. It's Skinny again. Oh. Hello. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, I don't know if I can get through here. Uh. That, John? Um, I probably can. Uh, yeah, you can hand it to me if you want. Can we just go in and then out? Or just... Yeah, you do. You just go in and out. That's do we have it. To come back this way? Yep. It does open up a bit up here, but I think this is pretty much it. Whew. Okay. Yeah. Oh no, it does keep going. like I could probably climb up this thing but I'm not going to I think this is gonna be the end of the road that was intense and this is beautiful back here okay. so we just came out of zebra slot and we're now trying the tunnel slot Canyon we made it about 10 feet and it looks like a wall so we'll see how far we get Okay. Gonna make our way up this huge pile of rocks. I don't know if these rocks were always here. This is the 
<laughs> maybe the tunnel collapsed. I don't know. Okay, so I'm going up ahead to scout out to see if this next slot canyon is even worth trying. Because if it's not, we'll have to walk back like, I don't know, like an extra mile that we didn't need to. So we'll see how it looks. Okay, I'm making the executive decision that it's just too far to get there. Because if it's not passable, that's a lot of extra walking. So I'm just gonna head back and tell them. driven even farther out in the middle of nowhere to the Devil's Garden. The Devil's Garden is more of a place to explore than it is a trail. There are a lot of rocks that you can climb on and this would probably be the ultimate place to play hide and go seek. This is our final stop in the Escalante, Utah area, and we're doing Lower Calf Creek Falls, which is a little over six miles and a very popular hike. Along the trail, there were several signs that gave information about the plants and also pointed out some of the petroglyphs along the walls. This hike was quite hot and we were very much looking forward to the water where we could cool off. Definitely a destination hike. There's a beautiful waterfall that we're almost to now, but really it's been just gorgeous the whole way. We have like the beautiful blue sky today, contrasted with the green plants, and then we have these massive rock walls on the sides. It's really a great trail. I think we're gonna chill out here for a little bit, eat a snack, and then probably head back. <laughs> this 
water is so cold, it's literally hard to breathe when you get in it. All right, that's it for our time here in Escalante, Utah. It's way out of the way, but it's beautiful. Uh, we have a big drive ahead of us. This adventure's been fun. Can't wait for the next one. Bye.